Hello my friends and welcome back. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Well, it seems like it might have happened and that is uh, Evgeny Prigozhin, the boss of Wagner mercenary group, was shut down. Um, I personally said this a long time ago. Actually, I said it on the 27th of um, June 2023 after uh, the mutiny. I made a video where I said uh, this, and you can go and check it out. Here is the video. Prigozhin tried to call Putin. Putin refused to speak with him. Prigozhin's days are numbered. This is the video I made on the 27th, right here on the bottom. Recording on June, June 27, 2023. I don't think it was a uh, genius uh, you know, prediction. But uh, these guys are trying to make it as a genius prediction. And I'm going to show you this. See this? <laughs> Business Insider. The CIA director predicted last month that Putin would seek revenge of Yevgeny Prigozhin after his failed coup. Well, you know what? You're not a genius CIA director because there's many of us who knew that it was obvious. So go back to the little rock that you just crawled out from and these guys are just trying to uh, build the CIA director's credibility. Oh, see, he's good, man. Well, if he's good, I'm better. And I'm, not, I'm not a CIA director. But anyway, it's not about me here. I have a video here showing Prigozhin's plane with his name on the passenger list falling down from the sky. I have questions regarding the videos. I'm going to point to the to the issues that I have with the video. There is the plane that's going to be going down and blowing and so on. And there's a little white little thing close to where the plane was. What is that? Was it a missile? I, remem I remember how Lebedev, Lebedev, Lebed, Lebed, General Colonel, he was shot down in um by vladivostok somewhere in um i can't remember what year that was he was in a helicopter and the helicopter uh, malfunctioned and he died <laughs> i think it was in in um uh, siberia somewhere at vladivostok in that area anyway check that out the same thing i said in this video from the 27th of june this guy is gonna be ending up like Probably Lebedev, or I think that's the, the way uh, the, his name. So let's go and get all these articles one by one, and then we go to the video. So let's go with these weasels first. Associated Press, private jet crashed in Russia, kills 10. Wagner chief Prigozhin was on passenger list. This is the article. Let's go to the next one. The Telegraph tells us, and we believe them, eight bodies recovered after Yevgeny Prigozhin's jet crashed. Live updates. So, uh, eight bodies have been recovered. Okay, it says that the Wagner mercenary boss was on board the aircraft when it came down, author authorities have said. So, that means he's dead. Now, the next one. This is the plane, the plane crash, the site where it crashed. I will get the video, don't worry. I don't want to drag you around with that. Ukrainska Pravda. Plane crashes in Russia. Prigozhin among passengers. Russian media. A small plane, blah, 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 blue, blue, blue. Okay, I will go back to these things. This is the video from Baza, but we're going to get to this one. Wagner Group leader Prigozhin reportedly dead in plane crash. And we have Russia Today. No, we're going to go Russia Today. Video shows Wagner boss plane crash media. All right, and here is a business insider. What is this? Not here. Let's go and see this video, okay? Now, I would like you to pay attention to this white stuff, all right? Because that's not the plane. The plane is going to, you're going to see a different, um, different, like a little cloud behind the crash, the, 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 the plane, the, the plane doesn't have that. I don't know what that is. I don't want to say it was a missile, but we're going to find out which time, right? Let's go. Oh, this guy started from the beginning. Yeah, you want to play like that? If you want to play like that, let's see what these guys have them. I'm going to use Baza. Ready? Set. And. Let's flip it down. Пиздец, это беспилотник. Сбили, бабахнуло в два раза, взорвалось, падает. Ну, что казалось? Ты посмотри, падает. 
No, that's not what I want. I want the other one. Now that I will use this one when I'm going to play it and we're going to see it together. All right, let's see what we got here. So that's the white stuff. This is where the airplane comes down. You see, this is where the airplane comes down. This is the white stuff. I don't know what it is. That is not a cloud. Here. My concern was with that little thing, I think. I don't know what he's saying. I don't want him to tell us things that YouTube will consider bad. Где, блядь, бабахнет? Okay. Куда упал? Он тут куски летят. Now, I don't know if there was an explosion of Где ты, блядь, упал? Like Хуя дым пошел какой. А там он куски летят еще. Смотри, какой клуб. Поднимается. Пиздец. Меня аж трясет. Нихуя. Вон. Тес, да? Look over there. All right, now we got this one covered. And again, I will play the beginning of this uh, video whenever it ends, because I, I'm, not, uh, I'm not convinced with that little white stuff. Right there, right there, what is that? What is that? Is that where the, the explosion was of the airplane? It, it's very, very, uh, how should I put it? Um, not not unnatural. The clouds, have you seen how the clouds were? And then you saw the, if you look back again at the airplane going down, it has a little bit of white stuff coming behind it, coming from the engine or engines. I don't know exactly if they had one or two. I'm assuming anyway one, but who knows. But the other stuff over there that's white, I don't know what that was. It was probably when it, the engine blew up and then it made a little, uh, and then, ew. nevertheless, um, I'm going to go to now and go to Sputnik because they say, what do we know so far? And this is 30 minutes ago. So that, that's the Russian update. So Russia, jet crash supposedly involving Wagner chief Prigozhin. What we know, this is 30 minutes ago. So probably right now is about uh, 45 minutes ago. So it says an Embraer legacy business jet went down near the town of Kuznenkino in Russia's Tver region earlier on Wednesday. While Russian emergency services are currently working to deal with the aftermath of this crash to determine the cause, here is what we know about this tragedy so far. The aircraft belonged to a company called MNT, Aero LLC, according to Russian authorities. The plane departed from Moscow International Airport and was bound for St. Petersburg. There were seven passengers. Remember these guys here? Private jet, Associate Press says 10. There were seven passengers and three crew. That makes 10, Emil. Good job. Members on board. So far, eight bodies have been found at the crash site. The passenger manifest for the plane contains the name of Evgeny Prigozhin, a Russian entrepreneur and founder of the PMC Wagner Group. At this time, it is not clear whether he was actually on board. Let's see if we're going to see something here. Oh, yeah. Oh, the guy made it. Wow. They don't show us that, obviously. Okay, well, we saw it all, my friends. We saw it all. Uh, as I said, uh, it's just a matter of time. Put and I, as I said before, Putin already 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 found a replacement for Prigozhin, but maybe maybe Prigozhin was not in their airplane. Maybe his name was over there. His body would be found, but Prigozhin will be somewhere else. If you know what I mean, like Elvis and Bruce Lee and others. And I don't you see in 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 the. Um, 
in the case of Elvis, which is dead, a uh, Bruce Lee dead, okay? In the case of these guys, uh, oh, they're still alive, they just uh, went somewhere, uh, they couldn't stand up, whatever, all right? Uh, I'm an Elvis fan, but no, <laughs> he's dead as dead they come and they go. But Prigozhin, I give you, I would say 60% he might not have been in that plane. Or let's say 50. Let's put it 50-50 that he was. He's dead, but he's not dead. He pulled an Elvis and a Bruce Lee uh, little conspiracy. We'll find out. Uh, both both things are equally true. Both. Uh, we'll find out. Maybe we'll never find out, actually. If how are they're not, not going to be able to identify Prigozhin. There's going to be someone over there and they say, oh, this is Prigozhin dead. And that's it. That's solve Prigozhin's uh, thing. I don't know, my friends. I don't know. I have a gut feeling. Not a gut feeling, but uh, maybe, as I said, these guys are, you know, he's dead, but he's not dead. Maybe, you know, uh, and I don't think that was an accident. I mean, I, I don't have any evidence. I have a gut feeling. I don't think it was an accident. And uh, I predicted exactly that. And I predicted this, I said, while... Prigozhin was still uh, active, supposedly, in uh, Bakhmut, in Bakhmut, and when he showed up and said, I'm over there, and I'm here, and I'm, I'm going to do this, and I'm going to do that, and the Ukrainian said, well, he's actually two miles away from Bakhmut, whatever. I made this point. How in the hell this guy's plane is not shut down? That's exactly what I said. I mean, he f or helicopter. He flies so much, and the Ukrainians are not capable of tracking his flights? Or other guys, enemies. Anyway, we'll see. We'll find out. So far, he's dead. I think if he was, uh, according to all these guys here, all the the articles, they are like, yeah, he's dead. Yell alleged, not allegedly, reportedly dead. He was on the list. He was supposedly in the plane. Thank you very much for being with me again today. I will consider him dead as of now until he shows up. And he, you know, from he. I'm pretty sure that if he would have been alive, he would have showed up. So far, say, no, I'm a nice try. He had enough time when that occurred. I don't think it occurred uh, uh, 30 minutes ago. Okay, it occurred hours ago, an hour, two hours. Do you think Prigozhin did not find out about that thing to come on Telegram or whatever he shows up over there and say, hey, <laughs> I dodged uh, this bullet. I think he, uh, he's dead. Or he's gone fishing, if you know what I mean, in Tahiti with a different. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Stay strong, stay smart, look for the truth and be just. I have a gut feeling, that's all.